Did you know that everything around you might have a mind of its own? Yes, you heard it right. This is the fascinating concept of panpsychism. Panpsychism is a philosophical theory that suggests that everything, no matter how small, has an element of individual consciousness. Imagine your coffee mug having a mind of its own, or the trees in your backyard experiencing their own form of consciousness. Sounds intriguing, doesn't it? This idea is not new. It has been around for centuries and has been ascribed to philosophers including Thales, Plato, Spinoza, Leibniz, William James, Alfred North Whitehead, Bertrand Russell, and Galen Strawson. In the 19th century, panpsychism was the default philosophy of mind in Western thought. However, it saw a decline in the mid-20th century with the rise of logical positivism. But don't worry, the 21st century has seen a revival in interest in panpsychism. But what does panpsychism really mean? It posits that the type of mentality we know through our own experience is present, in some form, in a wide range of natural bodies. This means that not just humans or animals, but even non-living things like rocks or buildings could have a primitive form of mentality. For instance, consider a rock. According to panpsychism, a rock could have its own form of consciousness. It might not be thinking about existential questions or pondering the mysteries of the universe like we do, but it could be experiencing its own forms of existence. Now let's take an example from nature, a tree. A tree might not have thoughts or emotions like humans do, but it could be experiencing its own form of consciousness, feeling the sunlight on its leaves, absorbing water from its roots, or even sensing the change of seasons. So next time when you're sipping coffee from your mug or sitting under a tree, remember? They might just be having their own little experiences. Panpsychism opens up a whole new way of looking at the world around us. It adds an extra layer of wonder to our everyday experiences and makes us realize that we are part of a much larger conscious universe. So let's embrace this fascinating concept and start seeing the world through the lens of panpsychism.